Hey fitness fans, I'm Ava Cowan and you're watching My Body Side TV, brought to you exclusively by MyBodySite.com. Episode, I showed you what to buy at the grocery store and I promised to show you a few simple meals you could prepare with the food we bought. I also took your suggestions from the comments in the last video so you better pay attention because I might answer your question. I also want to talk about the myth that you have to eat less or skip meals to lose weight when actually you need to eat all throughout the day. I eat six times a day to stay lean and fit and the reason is so that my metabolism is faster than let's say if I ate three times a day. A faster metabolism means you burn more calories. Okay, let's get cooking. I make sure to eat as soon as I get up in the morning. I know many of you don't feel hungry in the morning, but it's important to break the fast from the night before. And once your metabolism gets red from eating more often, you'll eventually wake up feeling hungry. It may take a few weeks, but it will happen. For my first meal, I normally have four egg whites and one whole egg, and two pieces of low-carb bread with one slice of low-fat cheese. Or I can have a half a cup of oatmeal instead of the bread. So if I'm really tired, I go ahead and I, um, I just have a scoop and a half of whey protein, and I have a half a slice of whole wheat bun, with a slice of low fat melted cheese on it. Cause see, it's more important to meet your macronutrient goals than what food source you get them from. So I'm looking for about 30 grams of protein, between 15 and 30 grams of carbohydrates, depending on what my goals are, and between five and 10 grams of fat at each meal. If you just take the time to figure out how many calories you need a day, Divide that by the number of meals you should be having, which is five or six, and that way you'll be able to meet your goals. So today I'm going to the beach. And just because I'm gone for a couple hours doesn't mean I'm gonna starve and wait till I get home to eat. So what I did is I made this easy to carry meal right here. It's a turkey burger. It's made with four ounces of 99% extra lean ground turkey. It's on a whole wheat bun and I have a slice of low fat cheese on here. So I made this and some other meals earlier in the week so that when I'm on the go I have something pre-measured and healthy to take with me. There is no guesswork. And also in our next video I'm going to show you how to eat on the go. Okay, time for the beach. <laughs> meal of the day, and for a lot of you it'd be called lunch. I'm going to show you my favorite spicy chicken recipe. To eat the right amount of calories and macronutrients, you really have to measure food. For instance, this is how I measure a cup of frozen vegetables. You can find a very inexpensive food scale to measure your meat. I got mine at Target for like five bucks, so you can get it anywhere. 
For this chicken dish, all you have to do is put a quick spray pan. You add the chicken, you go ahead and put the Szechuan sauce on and the chili powder. Go ahead and put the vegetables in and cover. Also, with my meal, I go ahead and make my Uncle Ben's brown rice. I personally have three-fourths of a cup of brown rice with my meal. Tune into our next episode. Next time on My Body Site TV. Favorite fruit juice like orange juice, apple juice. For my fifth meal, I'm...